Let's go. Let's go. So there's someone who likes our show, guys. Oh, as in that was someone who's really important. Yes. And Caroline, we took a really like ah! our show. Yes! Thank you, Caroline. Hey, Caroline. Nice. Hi. <laughs> Congratulations to you and your daughter on her graduation. It's just the cutest thing. Yes. I mean, they know her yeah. little cape and the. Yes. I love yeah. them. Look yeah. alike. And, they and do you know her daughter alike. is adopted. And yes. just amazingly. You know, I, I love the fact that she actually took a different approach from to motherhood. A lot of people are of the opinion that they want their own kin, their own blood. And she was like, no, I want to adopt a baby. Mm. And there's so many kids out there that need parents. I do I not know. know where this child would be without Caroline right yeah, now. I so yeah. It's can, I, can I be honest with you? Please tell me. She made me think about it, mm. about mm. adoption. And I me honestly well. think about, if I'm gonna have my second child, I think she'll be adopted. He, she will be For adopted. For me, what stands out about that. Caroline yeah. is she seems like she's always put together. She's <laughs> like, she can do it all. <laughs> like she's know? just the opposite of me. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I've, I'm fixed, I'm good, yeah. I'm perfect. Yeah. And she still always has something in there. Mm. Uh, and we need more of women like that to actually get recognized. Like, yes, can, can I I'm beautiful, yeah, I am so successful, true. and there's something in there. Can I say something that many people don't know, and I think I've never even said it to an, any interview? Sure. When uh, I decided to be a DJ, mm. it was because of Carol. She had a lot to do with it. When I did it the first, first place ever, yeah. and there was a rumor like, where is a DJ? Carol picked up her phone and called me. Uh -huh. She was like, hello, this is Carol Emotica. I was like, no, it's fake. not. That's a lie. That's not lie. I never even talked to that woman. Who are you? Who's faking? Is it those guys in committee, you know? I was just all over the place. <laughs> then I realized this chick is actually serious. Yeah. Then she's and like, she uh, I would love to meet you for lunch. I'm like, no, what have I done? <laughs> Who have I done wrong? Like, have yeah. I arrived? Who have I done wrong? Like, have I, I arrived wrong? <laughs> you guys, Pierre asked herself, Who have I done wrong? <laughs> Yeah. But anyway, like uh, she was like, you know what? You have what it takes. That is very different. Go for it. You know, I'd love to see you. I love to see you on TV DJing. I love to see you on radio mm. DJ. Like she talked to me and she bought me lunch. Wow. Like very good lunch. Like yeah, and she encouraged <laughs> me a lot. After that, my God, I just put on my gear and I was these, going. Now these are the yeah. loyal. These yeah, are the imagine. ones that we talk about. Yeah. But I love that she made an impact in yeah, your life directly, you know? Mm -hmm. So it's beyond, you know, what other people may see on mm -hmm. the screen. Like, she's really what you yeah. may actually see. So that's some good it's stuff. It's good to support no, each other as women. She mentors, she mentors a lot of women. Yeah. A lot of women, even um, Radio Africa, I, I tried out for a couple of times to get a job there. And even when I used to run into her, she'd just say, you know what, go for it. Yeah. Try it. As in the only thing you'll regret is not trying. I've never met her, so yeah, I'd like to see her right here, grabbing a seat on yeah, the table. We should invite her. 